Hi, my name is Yasmin Shavira. I work with Better Lesson on the Master Teacher Project and I teach seventh grade math. When I was reflecting on this unit and noticed some of the um, end activities that I had planned, like the one in this lesson, I realized this year that I had a lot of material here that I could separate into other lessons. Um, one lesson that I learned this year is that students need a lot of time to develop the conceptual understanding of the constant of proportionality, of dependent and independent variables, and separately the equation y equals kx. In fact, I found that if I take my time developing the understanding of the unit rate, the fact that you can calculate more than one in any given word problem situation, uh, using ratio tables as a strategy, if I can spend enough time doing those things, students actually end up discovering the equation in a much more organic and uh, in an easier way than if I'm trying to shove it down just because I'm trying to get to the end of the unit. So um, the activity with the card game within this lesson is a great one when we want to review all of the unit, getting ready before the unit test or perhaps even for a test prep session. Um, this is a great way to review uh, the entire ratios and rates unit is through that card activity. Now, um, through the class notes, you'll see that I've discussed and walked students through identifying the dependent and the independent variable. That lesson, I feel, should be an entire lesson of itself. Having kids read word problems, create ratio tables, and name the X and the Y as the dependent and the independent variables. Um, so th those are two things that I definitely wanted to do this year, and those materials are included in this section of the reflection. Hope that's helpful. Thank you.